Hey, what's up? What's up, YouTube? Yeah. No hashtag, no copies. I think, cause no one. I don't think anyone uses that. But what's up, YouTube? What's up, viewers? Oh, I'm about to play the game of life with my friends and with my friends. Let's go upstairs. Today, if you haven't already seen it, I got a Steam Siege kit. Another one. Another one. But yeah. Whew. Guys, I unboxed it. I, got, I was super disappointed. It didn't upload, actually. But I only got one EX. I was so disappointed. Oh, so mad. But I did get sleeves, which is kind of what I wanted. And I also got this. You'll get one if you get some sleeves. Um, these are all the faces of the packs. There. Ugh. <gasps> but yeah, uh, yeah, um, tomorrow, I have some mighty tricks for you, let's do it now, let's do it now, so, um, um, I'm gonna do it right now, so, think of a number between 1 and 10, okay, now take that number, you can write this down, multiply it by 2, Okay, now take that number and add 8. Okay? Take that number that you have and divide it by 2. Now take your original number that you thought of and subtract it. Here's my no, I'm to see you. And subtract it from the number that you just thought of. That you just have. Now, take that number into a letter. So, if it was 1, if your number that you have is 1, you do A. So, now think of a country that starts with that letter. Got it? Now go to, like, if it was A, it would be B. If it was D, it would be E. So, go to the next letter in the alphabet. And, oh, sorry. And, what is it? I'm forgetting. Oh, I just had this. And think of an animal. You got it? Now think of that animal's color. Okay. Were you thinking of a gray elephant in Denmark? Good. Um, I actually just had it written down right here. It's very simple. So first, you can write this down if you want to do it at home. You take... You ask him to do any number from 1 in 10. So, it should work with every number um, between 1 and 10. Because I tried it uh, already. So, it does work with every number. It should. Um, but, yeah. So, you're going to take it and multiply it by 2. Then, add 8. Divide it by 2. Take your original number. And basically everything I said, take your original number, blah, 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 turn it into an animal, <laughs> think of a country, and yeah. Uh, I have another one, too. Hold on. Um, think of an odd number between 1 and 50, okay? But both digits need to be odd, okay? Both digits need to be odd, and they can't be the same digit. So it can't be like 33 has to be like 37 or something so you got a number 37 you're basically already just if you go 1 in 50 you're eliminating half of them okay this is the secret so if you go 1 in 50 name an odd um, number in your head you're you're already eliminated half of them okay and make both digits so that's 1 through 10 out of there odd so and 
they can't think of like 33, but most people would think of 37. Okay? And my final trick. So, I have this prediction paper. I'm going to have it. I'm going to re-angle it here to right there. I'm going to have it laying right there. You can go ahead and pay attention to this. I wrote all of these down so I wouldn't forget for the video. Okay. What day does Christmas start? Or what day is Christmas on? Like, the Christmas Day, not Christmas Eve, Christmas Day. Say it out loud. December 25th. Okay. So, which number is in between 1 and 3? 2. What are hamburgers made of? Beef, which I'm answering them for me. Um, what side of the road do they drive on in Europe? Left. Think of a color and a tool. Got that down? Said all up. Was it red hammer? I'm going to teach you how to do this trick now. So, you're just going to write down red hammer. And write down all these questions, which is, I'm going to tell them right now. What day does Christmas start on? Or what day is Christmas? What number is in between 1 and 2? Or 1 and 3? What are hamburgers made of? What side of the road do they drive on in Europe? And if they don't know, say left. Dry. Um, think of a color and a tool. They're just going to say red hammer. It just anticipates it into their mind. If this does work, it worked on me when I saw um, when, when uh, I mean, it worked for me uh, when I did it on my parents. So, that's the video. Three easy mind reading tricks that you can write down on paper and do on your friends. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Leave a like. And if all these worked on you, leave a comment of the fate of your favorite video that we have ever posted and do it anyway. And yeah. Hashtag Steam, steam Siege. Um, wait, I'm gonna actually get it. Oh, here it is. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take all the cards that I have and convert them into here. So, I have all these, like, they're in sleeves. So, I have one of these. I have one of these. Magic EX. That was my first EX. These two I got today. I was super excited for th This one is what I got out of the Steam Siege. This one I got extra packs. And it was like, I was so happy to get it. And I got a break, which you seen already so yeah that is everything i accidentally picked up a couple cards and so that's everything i have i have more sleeves than blah blah, blah. <laughs> but yeah and then mini pokedex and then i have like all my best cards here oh i didn't know i had these from for now all my best cards and I have a nine tails. Yes, I do. So I put like, this is for the sneaky. And I always leave a spot open. Why is that turned around? Should be right there in the middle. There we go. And I just leave a spot when, if I don't have an energy. I just leave that spot open. So, I'm gonna get more like dragon types. Why do I have two bastions like different? Never mind, they're in the same spot. So, and this is like my mini Pokédex just for the Steam Siege. Hope you enjoyed, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave a like. What I said earlier, bam! Use these on your friends. Goodbye. See, see you next time.